basically going to take the boom off the excavator. We're going to put a shorter boom on and then we have more power and it's easy to get a bucket hole. It should be a lot more productive. Tony's plan, remove the 950's 28-foot boom and replace it with a 24-foot boom. The shorter arm will generate more force and concentrate digging power. What do you got then? So, I foresee pulling that pin out is going to be a pain in the ass. Says who? Me. James. Yep. Double wrap that half inch chain around one of those uprights. Around one of them? Double wrap it. Good. Hook it up, wrap it up. It's not going to work with the slip hook, is it? Oh, really? What if you double wrap it, it does? <laughs> 54 and a half, and that is five. I'm hoping that pin doesn't jump out of there, Frig. No, that's why he's pulling with the bucket, not the loader. Okay. Really, a bucket a bit. Pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. No. That's sweet. <laughs> oh no, I hooked it up, remember? Yeah, I do. You ready for the boom? Yeah. Good, go for it. Let's put it on the ground, who cares? We got the boom off, now put this one on, and then we'll see how far we're gonna get today. Okay, lift the thing up. Let's go, hook it up. Whoa. Put some good pressure on it. But Wait, wait, wait. James, what's my cab? What's the paint? Hang in there for a second, Sam. Okay, have a bit. James, push it over a bit. Put the in. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So that yeah. went nice. That was pretty slick. Thanks, <laughs> nice. Woo!